Hey, what is going on everyone? Welcome back. In today's video, we are going to be doing, hopefully going to see if we can get through all of the stuff today. And just before I get into today's video, I just want to show off my livery that I've done for the Bone Shaker. I've done a Rick and Morty livery. Uh, you can download the livery right now. You can go ahead, get it. It helped me out a lot if you guys can drive around it, like it, share it around, tell your friends. I actually put a lot of effort into this. It took me a lot longer than I expected because I'd get the name down and Rick and Morty themselves. I reckon I did a decent job, but yes. But we're going to get straight into it today. I want We've got two more cars I want to try out from this DLC. Uh, I know there's like a lot more, but I want to test them out. So we're going to do a S1 race that we need to complete. So where's an S1? Here's an S1 right here. So we're going to go ahead do this S1 and we will be doing it in the Hot Wheels Ford Mustang because I've not actually given it a go yet. Alright, so here we go guys. Uh, we're going to start it up, obviously win it, finish the race, and earn uh, 45,000 skill points and we are going to be using the Ford Mustang. So let me just go all the way to it, wherever it is. Here she is, with my own little livery on it too, so guys, please go help me out. Check out some liveries of mine. Check out my storefront, see if you like any of the liveries, it will help me out a lot if you guys go ahead, download them and like them and use them. Alright guys, here we go. Starting her up, look at my car, looks beautiful. Um, Just kind of get straight into it, I don't want to waste too much time doing this. So I have, I actually have not given this car a try yet. Um, it's meant to be good. I actually, yeah, like I said, I haven't given it an actual drive around the track yet. So we'll find out how it goes. Oh, I um, I, I'm not really taking the corners well. Oh, you know, what, we're not gonna even bother. We're just gonna keep going. Hopefully, I can catch up. Off, this is a sprint race, so I have to be careful about how I'm gonna do stuff. So. I need to make sure I catch up. I'll get a jump straight away. Why the hell would you slow down? Someone's taking a little tough there. Is that another Mustang? No, that is a Porsche. But we're slowly catching up. Oh shit. Thank you, car, for helping me do that. I go this way, everyone else goes that way. Alright, so straight away, I am thoroughly enjoying using this thing. It's a, a, quite a decent car. Automatic S1. And it, it is it is actually really good to use. If you guys do not have it, go ahead, purchase it. Like always, it is for free anyway. Oh, Christ. Um, I'm going to rewind that. Holy Christ. I was not expecting that at all. Okay, we didn't get three stars, but we did get two. I'm okay with that. I don't even know what car that was. Or TVR. Um... Okay, so we got two stars, that's okay. But everyone failed on that corner in that air. It was a pain in the butt, I can tell you that. But we did get two stars, so we're getting closer. We only need four, no, six more stars before we can do the Goliath. So basically, all we have to do is do three more events, I mean two more events and get three stars. Uh, so let's have another look. I want to do an S2 race now to showcase another car that I have not shown off yet. So we're going to go ahead and do this as soon as possible. So here we go. Like always, we have to do this stuff to win. So we have to just get two awesome speed skills, which shouldn't be too hard in the car I'm going to be selecting. So here, where is it? Um... 
is one of the brand new cars in the game, and it's the Zembo ST1. Okay, I've heard rumors about this car being, it's an alright all car, but at the same time, it could be slightly better. But, we'll find out, won't we? I'm using this car properly against all other cars. I've driven around a little bit with it, and free there's a nice beastie sounding car, I gotta admit. But it doesn't exactly match up to most of the other cars, I reckon. It's too I reckon it's slower than all the other cars. But it's alright, it handles quite smoothly. I do like using this. Alright, we still need to get the two speed skills, two awesome speed. Hopefully we can get it on this, because the boosters, there's one. And we're done! Awesome! Now we just need to focus on winning the race and finishing the race. You get three stars. Okay, that was a lot easier than I thought. Okay, so, that, yeah, there was a lot <laughs> that jump in the background. So we did come first, and another Zembo came second, so it must be an alright car. Like I said, I've not really used this that often in these races, so it kind of, it's an un, it, I reckon it's going to be one of the cars that's going to be uh, put to the side and people don't Boss, think it's going to be good. This is supposed to be top secret, but you can see it from 10 miles away, and I'm rubbish at keeping secrets, so I'll just tell you. They're prepping the track for the Hot Wheels finale. It's gonna be big. Well, thank you, Warren. I know it's gonna be big, so... <laughs> I hope we can do this. I reckon if I unlock it, I will be doing it in a, its own separate video. So, um... We've got... I'm gonna do a jump now, just to do something really quick and easy. Get it up there, and then we'll do... I don't know, end the video over there. Or something, I don't know what I should do. Okay, so I've just fast traveled to a bit on the map. We're right in front of it, but we are going to be doing a speed trap, seeing if we can get three stars. We have to be going 250 something kilometers an hour, I'm pretty sure. I can't recall what it actually said, but we will be doing that. And we're using the loop to loop to our advantage. We would, and we should be able to go that fast. All right, here we go. I'm running right next to Kona's egg. Gotta try hitting 250 kilometers an hour. You have arrived at Alright, did I get three stars? We'll find out. New personal best. I did kind of screw up a little bit. Yes, three stars, guys. Oh, wait, never mind. See, I thought... Oh, I didn't realize I did that with only one star. So there's one... We need one star. One star, guys. Oh, because it has to be something around here. Is this... Speed trap. Oh, we haven't done. I think the only way of us actually hitting that perfectly and nicely is by coming up here... For some reason I keep I can't get this speed trap down at all for some reason. Keep left. Yeah, I'm gonna need to use a better car. So I'm gonna pull out a uh, car that I've done up. And it is a Hot Wheels car. I've got two bone shakers. This one is fully maxed out. All wheel drive. This thing can fly. So I'm hoping I can get the speed trap. The idea is I hit it at 322 kilometers an hour, but the handling on this is very, very bad, so. You bastard! We did it, come on, tell me we did it. Roll for victory! <laughs> Yes! We've got a hundred stars, so progress will be continuing and we'll have a look at what we have to say about this. Oh shit. Boss, this is it. They have something they're 
calling the ultimate Hot Wheels experience. Horizon didn't design this one. We just told them we needed a finale, and it had to be massive. Going on past experience, maybe we shouldn't have said that. All right, guys, so we've unlocked the Hot Wheels Goliath. So, m the idea with this is now, since we've unlocked it, I will be doing this in a separate video. So, I'm ending the video right here, guys. I hope you did enjoy today's video, let alone it was a lot smaller, because there wasn't much for us to do. So, without further ado, I hope you did enjoy today's video, and please like it if you did, and also if you're new to my channel, and you like videos such as this, please subscribe. Until next time guys, I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.